Hi, I'm Jordan from TTT Studios. Welcome to our ongoing series where we ask our team members some of the most common questions asked in tech. Today in the hot seat, we have David Hobbs, our TTT co-founder and VP of Operations. So David, we've heard a lot about AI and there's obviously a lot of potential there, but we've also heard a lot about automation. For companies looking to incorporate one or the other, what's the difference between the two? Ooh, that's a good question. And, and there's a lot of gray area here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to simplify it a little bit. So um, I'll, first I'll talk about an automation. So okay. an automation is taking a mundane task or a repeatable task and removing the human from it. Mm -hmm. So uh, I'll give an example here. In a car, I could be driving down the road. I no longer want to put my foot on the gas pedal. Mm -hmm. I use cruise control. Okay. And there's the simplistic task. I remove my foot, mm -hmm. but I still maintain going at the same speed. But the problem with that is mm -hmm. there's a wall in front of me. I still continue with the same velocity. Yeah. We know how that ends. Okay. So AI or artificial intelligence takes data points into consideration. And again, using the same um, example in a car, uh, we'll use automatic braking. Okay. So I'm going down the road at the same velocity, even using cruise control. Mm -hmm. But the car itself is telling the, uh, the brakes hey, there's things around me, there's things around me. So it's sensing, it's using data. And if it sees that wall, it won't continue at the same velocity. It will actually say, hey, dude, there's a wall in front of you. Yeah. Let's slow down and they automatically slow down. So that's the main difference between an AI mm -hmm. and an automation. Right. So when would we use one over the other? Yeah, I, I think if we're using a simplistic task, an automation is great. It's, it's, it's a good way to save things. If we have a lot of data, then AI is, is, is a really good example. And, okay. you know, I, they actually work really well together. And I, I use an example of um, an assembly line. So, sure. you know, we're going to assemble baby cribs. Mm -hmm. Why not? Okay. So as the baby cribs are coming down the assembly line, the tasks that a human would be doing put together, a machine would be doing. And that's an automation. Okay. However, if we use AI, so we put some cameras, we actually are testing the quality of those cribs mm -hmm. as it's putting together. Right. Then we could see, oh, is it good? Is it bad? Uh -huh then a task can be, um, uh, basically the, the computer can say that is passes the quality that fails and then it can do a choice between the two of how it should react. Okay. And that's more the AI side of things. So putting them together gives you a really good system. Nice, that's super interesting. Thanks, David. Oh, thank you. Great, thanks so much for watching and be sure to check out our blog for more insights into AI technology and follow us on social media so you don't miss any updates. We'll see you next time.